hi, I'm Joe Masada, and this is another tip of the day. You know, I recently got a new laser, which is called the Light Touch. What I really like about this, it has its own water supply, and it's both hard and soft tissue, and it has multiple different tips. Now, right now, I have a tip on for maybe hard tissue, but I would like to just kind of show you how easy this is to work. We go here, and I've just now punched up I am going to open up and maybe uncover an implant. You could also use this for retracting uh, around an implant, especially once you've taken off the uh, healing abutment. Many times the tissue will just kind of collapse. So I, I want to be able to open that up and then put in an abutment. And at the same time, if the height of the sulcus is too large, you can actually reduce it. So very simply, we'll then basically have this ready and we have to put it that we are ready to do. Just gonna let you see the water flow, how it goes. You kind of see that and you hear the noise. And if you look, the light is actually on all the time. You will see uh, uh, occasionally uh, a flicker, but look how that water flows. And I'm gonna now demonstrate how I'm gonna go directly into the mouth I'm going to go around some abutments and I'm going to then take the abutments out and put in the final abutments. And if it's not uh, exactly what I want, I can actually take a little bit more off and it clots very nicely. I had four abutments, four implants and four abutments and the sulcus heights were actually six and eight millimeters. And of course, if I put in an abutment that was, you know, eight, nine millimeters, it actually takes up more space. So what I did is I just reduced down, as long as I had attached gingiva, I just reduced the sulcus to a three millimeter depth, put in the abutment, checked it. If it looked like it didn't have enough off, I can go back. Bloodless and very easy to do. We can do phrenectomies, hard tissue with this. It's very, very, look how small it is. And it's so easy to utilize with your screen uh, touch here, you can actually go from whatever procedure you want and it will automatically set the water spray and automatically set the amount of power that's coming out. Well, I hope you enjoyed uh, today's tip. Tomorrow I'll give you another one. Thanks.